Hello and welcome to another Sander Factory 5 minute tips video. In this video we're exploring the molecular analysis machine or MAM. To access the MAM you need to have the field research milestone unlocked. If you haven't you can do this from the hub. You will need 300 wire, 300 screws and 100 plates for this. Once unlocked, you can place the MAM on the ground. Just make sure the front is facing towards you. The MAM is used to unlock important items and functions in the game. For example, you need it to unlock better healing and scanning for advanced resources. But you can also unlock items to make your factories more efficient. When you find an item in the world that has a research tree, that tree will open up in the MAM. Any research trees for items you found before unlocking the MAM will immediately be available when you unlock the MAM. In my case, the alien organisms tree is already available because I have some alien carcasses from killing piggies. You start research on an item by selecting the item in the tree and clicking the start research button. You will need to have the proper amount of items in your inventory. Research takes some time, sometimes, like now, just 3 seconds, but there are research notes that take minutes to complete. You can only have one research active at a time. New recipe unlocked. To unlock other levels of the tree, you will need every item that comes before it unlocked. When you move the mouse pointer over a box, you can see exactly which items need to be unlocked and which ones it unlocks. For example, in this tree, you will need to unlock the top three items in order, but once you have unlocked this one, the next level opens up where you can research four different items in any order. The item here has two parents that need to be researched. So you can only start that when both items have been unlocked. When you find a new item in the world you can research, Ada will tell you. This is one of multiple edibles we have detected in your vicinity which are within approved nutritional and medical categories as established by R&D. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Let's unlock it. New object added to the object scanner. So that unlocked scanning for those berries with the object scanner. Let's try something else. shows this as a mix of sulfide and sulfate minerals. A new research tree exploring volatile self-defense applications can now be accessed in the MAM. Time to unlock this! New resource added to the resource scanner. So now we can scan for more sulfur with the resource scanner. One other very important item to research with the MAM are hard drives. You will find these scattered across the map in drop pod locations such as this one. Each drop pod requires a sacrifice from you in the form of some items you need to provide to release the hard drive. Some drop pods also require power. Data on the hard drive has been salvaged and can be repurposed to unlock an alternate recipe. Like Ada just told us, when researching this with the MAM, it will unlock alternate recipes. These recipes provide other ways to manufacture items. Researching a hard drive takes 10 minutes. After the research is finished, we get three recipes to choose from. Most alternate recipes are much better than the original. There are, however, also recipes that are worse than the original, so be careful which recipe you pick. There are even a few recipes that you can only unlock from hard drives and cannot get any other way. For example, for turbo fuel, which is a much better fuel than regular fuel. And here's an extra tip to get the best recipes from hard drives. If you save the game before you start the hard drive research, 
You can reload the game when you do not get the recipes you were looking for. You do need to save before starting the research because if you save when it started, the recipes will already have been selected and you will get the same ones. And that's it for our 5 minute look at the map. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'm also on Twitter and I regularly stream Satisfactory live on Twitch.